the somatic narcissist. Now this is the narcissist that's going to be all about their looks. We can have people who work on their looks. We can have people who go to the gym that aren't narcissistic people. They do it for their own mental health. They do it for their own physical health. They can be humble about it or they might try to help others with similar mental health and physical health issues. When it comes to a somatic narcissist, it's all about the looks and it's all about the looks that matter to that individual narcissistic person. Anything that doesn't match their look, they are going to talk badly about. They are going to mock. They're going to criticise. They're going to judge. They're going to be very boastful. They're going to be very arrogant about their looks. Again, whatever it is to that individual, the look that that narcissist is looking for. If people don't match the look that the narcissist wants, they're going to criticise and judge that person. They're going to exclude that person. And it can be down to things such as the family home. It can be down to the clothes they wear. It can be down to their body image, their face image. It's all about the image and selling an illusion to those around them of who they are. And they are arrogant with it. They might have the charismatic charm to sort of sell themselves to other people. However, they are arrogant because they don't recognise their own inadequacies within themselves. They're not willing to help other people. They're willing to tear other people down to make themselves feel better. When it comes to a somatic narcissist, they are going to make you feel worthless so that they can feel superior to you. They're going to go all out to diminish who you are as a person so they can feel better about who they are as a person.